The key to real power lay with the Streltsy, that restless army formed by Tsar Ivan the Terrible, almost a hundred years before. In an effort to seize power for herself, my half-sister Sofia lied to the Streltsy and turned them against my mother and me. Something's wrong. What is it? Sophia told the Streltsy that you're going to murder Ivan and put Peter on the throne. They're only minutes away. Why would my own sister say a thing like that? Because she wants to be Tsar. She means to kill both of you. Hide and don't let anyone know where you are. I don't know who to trust. Where is the Patriarch? Prince Rodanovsky is trying to get him to stop the Stelzi. If he can't, General Sheremetsi will defend the palace. <laughs> Everything is going as planned. Where is Ivan? In the East Chapel with Father Theodosius. Mm -hmm. I'm not your wife. I... I'm anxious this could be the beginning. <laughs> or the end, or something in between. It usually is. I wish I could be that casual about it. In any case, God will decide. We outnumber them a thousand to one. God has nothing to do with it. You sound like Peter. I'm his sister, Vasily. why I'm praying. They will die because the Streltsy have been told that the region Natalia wants to murder Ivan. That is a secular matter. I can only pray for the souls of both sides. They were misinformed, <laughs> deliberately, by the Tsarevna Sofia. The church is eternal. It cannot concern itself with temporal conflicts. It had better, because if anything happens to Natalia and Peter, there will be civil war. The church cannot involve itself with politics. Only because of that can it survive. It will not survive with anarchy, Theodosius. You better get out there and tell them the truth. That Ivan is still alive. 
that Natalia does not mean to kill him. I'm speaking for the Council of Boyaz. I doubt you speak for the entire Council. This does. Pray, Peter. I am. Pray properly. Kneel. You want God to listen to you, don't you? I beg God listens when you're standing up, too. Where'd you get these ideas? No one knows God's mind. I do. Lord, forgive my son his arrogance and his blasphemy. Imperial Highness, the Council does not believe that the Regent Natalia planned to murder Ivan, and I do not believe it. Show Ivan to the Streltsy. Stop the rumors. Tell them it was all a mistake. They were misled by unknown parties. That will stop the attack. But then Natalia will be free to put our dear little Peter on the throne. That would be difficult if you were named Regent. But how can I be Regent? Natalia is Regent. Come the Streltsy, and I promise you, you will become Regent. Streltsy! You have been told lies! Ivan is alive! Must continue. The Regent Natalia and her son Peter are hidden. Your orders are to find them and wipe out this stain on the honor of your country. Oh. My children! My children! Hear me! Ivan is alive and in good health. No one wants to kill him. He is here with the Ravna Sofia. Streltsy, lay down your arms. This is your Tsarevich, Ivan. And here is your royal family. United in tranquil harmony. Strelzi, guardsmen, citizens. The Regent Natalia, distressed by these events, has resigned. The Council of Boyars has, by acclamation, appointed Tsarevna Sofia as Regent. <laughs> The only way. Me, a guest in my own palace? Be patient. God forgive me, Peter's brother is not well. He won't live long. 